How's it going everyone? This is Yixarb here and welcome to an update video. Uh, one that will hopefully end up being on the shorter side, but as you guys know, I tend to have a rambling problem and uh, it may go a little bit longer, but if we can get this to about 10 minutes or less, that would be perfect. So let's just go ahead and dive on in. Uh, this video is uh, uh, purpose is twofold. Uh, first is just to give you a general update on our channel, you know, just sort of what our video schedule looks like, how things are looking just generally speaking for the channel going forward for the remainder of this semester, which is only, uh, which only has about eight or so weeks left in it. And the second purpose is of course, to let you know sort of how the pandemic is affecting both Bosnia and Cheese and myself and our personal and YouTube lives. And when I say pandemic, I imagine most of you understand what I'm talking about. Um, I'd be amazed if you didn't, that's uh, where I'm gonna leave that. But anyway, getting on with the general updates. So our video schedule, as you've likely seen at this point in our new phase, uh, consists of weekly videos uh, with alternating episodes between our Resident Evil 4 uh, TMP only no merchant run that I am recording uh, or that I am playing with uh, Andy, my brother, and uh, Star Wars Battlefront 2, which is a solo series by Bosnian Cheese. And currently, we have videos scheduled to go out weekly, and they're already uploaded uh, through uh, May 21st of this year. Uh, and that's every Thursday. That's typically how it's been going, and that's the plan going forward. Uh, and that basically takes us through the remainder of the semester. My last day of the semester, I believe, is May 15th or 16th. So that's actually really good. You know, we're way ahead in terms of that. Uh, you know, that's basically, what, another six or seven weeks from now? That's pretty good. And um, in case you didn't do the math, which I doubt you did, uh, our Resident Evil 4 and Star Wars series are uploaded right now through Episode 6 each. So Episode 6 of Resident Evil 4 and Episode 6 of Star Wars are both scheduled to go up. And they will continue to alternate until Episode 6 of Resident Evil 4 goes up. And you're probably wondering why there would be a change. Well, this is where I tell you some bad news. So, a few weeks ago, actually more than a few weeks ago now, it feels like it was at least a month ago, um, I lost all of the Resident Evil 4 footage that we recorded after episode 6. Basically, I was in the middle of editing videos, and my, uh, my internal drive on my laptop that I edit on uh, was starting to fill up. So I did what I normally do once every couple of weeks or so, which is I transfer the data from it to an external drive uh, <clears throat> uh, to take the space off of the laptop and then transfer other footage that needs to be edited back onto the laptop. That's kind of how it works. And so what I did was I transferred it over and I transferred new footage that I was going to edit onto the laptop. And I, of course, at that point, deleted all the old footage that was on it. Then, later on, when I was looking for uh, particular video files for Resident Evil 4 to continue editing Episode 7 and onward, I realized that the files weren't there. And this was a few days after uh, having, I suppose, accidentally deleted them. And this was, of course, a huge worry I had. I was more stressed out than I had probably ever been uh, regarding YouTube. You know, I had never made a mistake like this before. I was just astounded. But... After all sorts of trial and error, even using a uh, professional software, recovery software, although I was able to retrieve most of the foot well not most of the footage, I was able to retrieve probably 40% of the footage or so. It wasn't a clean 40%. Um, it was, you know, still corrupted. It had, you know, periods of, uh, of, uh, what do you call it? Uh, static, I guess? Static? and just uh, fuzziness along with uh, muted sections where the sound wasn't working. It was just a mess. So basically what Andy and I have decided to do is re-record uh, that portion of the game, which is unfortunate. I mean, that's a few hours lost, <laughs> uh, a few hours of work lost, but we'll make it back. You know, we're, we're, not, we're not terribly worried about that. In fact, at this point, we've already worked our way back up through the story. Uh, to right before chapter 3-2, which is where uh, the uh, sixth episode ends. So we just have to re-record it at this point. Of course, that kind of uh, gets us <laughs> into the next big issue, and that is the pandemic, as I referenced it, as I referenced to uh, earlier in this video, and how it's sort of affecting not just us, but everybody in the world, but of course here 
um, I'm going to be discussing us in particular. So, regarding Resident Evil 4 first, because that is of course the concern. As you guys know, Star Wars Battlefront 2, Boz and Cheese fully recorded that series many months ago. Probably closer to a year now than to six months, I'd say. And so, if we're somehow not able to record Resident Evil 4 by the time, you know, late May comes around, in order to avoid gaps in our videos, what we'll do instead is just upload more Star Wars Battlefront 2 videos in a row and just keep doing that until we have more Resident Evil 4 footage uh, or videos to put out. So that's kind of the plan. Um, but obviously due to the pandemic, uh, traveling is heavily discouraged and neither Andy nor myself are going to drive across the state um, and potentially infect ourselves or infect others. And I mean, just for, you know, some YouTube videos, especially considering the fact that we're not going to run out of videos for another six to seven weeks for Resident Evil 4. So it's not a rush on our part, but we'll just sort of see how that goes. We're going to play it by year and uh, just see how it goes. And like I said, we have Star Wars Battlefront 2 to upload on its own just uh, weekly at a time. Uh, we could go on for another at least couple of months, like what, two or three months with just doing that. So we will not have a problem. I'm sure we'll be fine. But in terms of uh, how the pandemic is affecting Boz and Cheese and myself outside of Resident Evil 4, this is what's going on. So as you may know, as many of you may know, Boz and Cheese and I like to record our series ahead of time. We like to record videos months in advance uh, to continuously stay ahead of our schedule and uh, which allows us to be consistent in our uploading schedule and everything else and in our planning, etc. Unfortunately, we're not going to be able to do that. It's not that we're specifically avoiding one another, but Bosnia and Cheese has decided to move back down south to be with family. Um, <clears throat> as you may know, the only reason either of us, either of us are up here uh, is for school. <laughs> and because of the pandemic, all of our classes have gone online. So Bosnia and Cheese was like, well... If I'm only here to go to class, and classes are no longer in person, they're just over the computer, why would I stay here? So he decided to go down and be with his family during these uncertain times, and uh, of course I think that was the absolute right thing to do. My situation is a little different. As you all know, I'm I'm married, I have my own pets, uh, I, ba I basically live here. I technically work here still, but I of course work from home at this point during the pandemic. Um, <clears throat> as a lot of people are, who are able to work from home, of course. I'm very fortunate in that I am able to. But basically, what that means is, since we're not in the same location, we can't record collaboration series. Uh, there's technically nothing stopping either of us from recording solo series of our own. However, two things. One, it's just, you know, at the end of the semester. This is actually the end of my final semester of law school and higher education as a whole. I... I'm very busy. I really do not have the time at this point to go ahead and uh, start prepping and recording, prepping for and recording a brand new series. It's just not in the cards at this point. Maybe, maybe if things lighten up over the next few weeks, but I'm not going to hold my breath on that. And so that's the first point. The second point is there's really no need to record any more series at this point. I mean, Resident Evil 4 and Star Wars Battlefront 2 are going to be going on for. I, uh, I don't know how many, how many more months. I haven't actually done the math on that. Uh, but even if we aren't able to record any more Resident Evil 4 until that and our Star Wars Battlefront 2 footage is out and we can't upload anything else from either of those series until we record more Resident Evil 4, we'll still be good for probably two to three months, like I said. So definitely no rush in terms of anything. <clears throat> if there's anything that there is a rush on, it's... Um, recording more Resident Evil 4, but I already explained to you why that's not going to happen uh, anytime soon, but we'll see. So, yeah, we're both, both Boz and Cheese and myself are, you know, doing everything from home. He's doing his extracurriculars and classes uh, from home. I'm schooling, I'm working, I'm doing everything from home. It's, uh, it's really quite, uh, jarring, <laughs> really. Um, it's hard sometimes to not go a little stir crazy being inside at all times, but of course it is you know the right thing to do at this point of the pandemic. Uh, even though you know both of us are young and healthy, um, it's just better for everyone around us 
to you know basically not <clears throat> become vectors for the for uh, for infection. You know, it just it would be a terrible thing if we got other people ill uh, simply because we felt like going outside. So that's definitely not something we are trying to do. So there you go. That's <laughs> that's basically uh, how it's affecting us. You know, we're at home at all times, but honestly. I'm sure both of us will count ourselves blessed and lucky if the extent of the effect of the pandemic on us consists of us being at home for a couple of months or a few months or however long it lasts. That's really nowhere near as bad as it could get for anybody. So like I said, we should count ourselves lucky if that's in, if that ends up being what happens. But there you are, guys. That's kind of, uh, that's kind of all I have to say right now. I know a little bit more of a... There was a little bit more of a serious tone to this video. Um, that's not typically how I handle these, but I feel like it's appropriate given the circumstances of the world at large. <clears throat> and basically I've uh, told you everything I needed to tell you. And just to recap, um, Resident Evil 4 and Star Wars Battlefront 2 are gonna continue to upload alternatively once a week. So every other week Resident Evil 4 will go up and every other week after that Star Wars Battlefront 2 goes up. So one video a week every Thursday, at least through near the end of May. Um, and if we haven't recorded more Resident Evil 4 by then, then Star Wars Battlefront 2 videos will continue to go, uh, continuously every week until they run out. And then if we're still behind on Resident Evil 4 at that point, we'll figure something else out. I'll figure out another series to maybe put out or it all kind of depends because at this point, I'm not sure if the bar exam that I'm signed up for at the end of July is going to take place. It might be postponed to September and you know, if that is the case, then I'm going to have to change my uh, studying schedule. But again, I don't want to delve into all of this way in the future, multiple months into the future uh, types of stuff, because it's just all so hypothetical at this point. We'll just see how it goes. But continuing on with the recap, Bosnia and Cheese and I aren't living in the same town at this point, and we won't be for the foreseeable future because he, he's not doing summer classes. So he'll remain down south with the family over the summer so at, probably until the end of august he won't be back up here and that's assuming classes go back to being in person at that time <clears throat> which you know at this point we don't really know but that's okay um we've got videos to go on for now we've got stuff to uh entertain all of you and i'm sure you know we're not the only youtubers that you watch uh, <clears throat> we definitely watch more than just one channel but it's always nice to have channels out there especially uh entertainment channels uh, to help keep everyone distracted and get through the day and just, you know, liven up someone's day if possible. So there you are, guys. If you have any questions about, um, you know, how the pandemic is affecting us going forward, um, feel free to leave comments on this video or any other videos that come out week to week. Continue to stay tuned for Resident Evil 4 and Star Wars Battlefront 2 and uh, probably for another update at some point. Um, like I said, I have... Four weeks left, I actually I may have not said this, but I have four weeks left of class, two weeks of finals after that, and so six weeks left until I'm done with school forever, so that might warrant another uh, video, but like I said, we'll see. Anyway, sorry about uh, taking longer than I expected. I was hoping for 10 minutes, but I'd say 13 to 14 <laughs> is close enough. This is probably the shortest one I've managed to make, especially uh, considering all that I've had to say. So thanks again for watching, everyone, and uh, stay safe out there, and we'll see you next time.